This demo will show you how to upload documents. After logging in, on the right-hand side of the screen, you will see four different ways to upload a document. The first option is to upload a single file. In order to upload a file here, your file will need to be one of the accepted formats. I have entered in details for the three fields. All fields are optional, and now I'm clicking on Choose File. I have located my file, and now I click Open. I can see my file here and then click Upload. You will be shown a status bar and when the file upload is complete you will be directed to the folder the document was submitted to. Files may not be larger than 20 megabytes. The second upload file is zip file upload. You may upload up to 200 megabytes and 1000 files within zip uploads. The third upload method is drag and drop and is similar to the file upload submission method. Lastly is cut and paste. This option is important for file formats that are not accepted by our system. You can see the paste box here. For each option, except for zip upload, you have the choice to enter a document title and an author's first and last name. If you leave these fields blank, the document title will default to the name of the file and the author name will default to anonymous. On the top left, you will be reminded to confirm the folder group and folder in which you wish to upload. The file is defaulted to be uploaded to the folder that was selected prior to clicking on an Upload Option link. As you can see, it's very simple to upload documents. To watch more demos, visit Authenticate.com resources.